Hi, I'm Danielle and this is Jacob and we're here from Jordan River Learning Federation with Ben from Green Glory Farm. So Ben, what's your role here at Green Glory Farm? Uh, so I'm the farm manager, so I'm in charge of all the day-to-day -day operations here within the business. What's your favourite part of being a farm manager? Uh, look, I really enjoy working outdoors, definitely get to do a lot of that, uh, managing the farm, uh, enjoy working with animals, um, and enjoy working with people as well. Um, and this position definitely gives me the opportunity to do all of that. What experience and education do you have? Uh, upon leaving school I did a 12-month rural traineeship uh, through TAFE up in Burnie uh, and then returned back to the farm uh, after a few years. Uh, when I stepped into the management role I decided I needed to expand my education so I travelled to uh, Victoria to an ag college over there and did a, a three-year advanced diploma in farm business management course. So Ben, who's suited to something like this? Um, someone that enjoys agriculture, someone that enjoys working outdoors, um, enjoys working with animals I guess, and, and I guess has got a good work ethic. So what does a typical day look like? Oh look, uh, as far as farming there's probably no such thing as a typical day, but um, yeah, so we milk every day, so that starts at 4am of a morning, goes through to about 7, then we start milking again in the afternoon at about 3, goes through till 5. In between then it can be a range of things from feeding calves, uh, feeding cattle, uh, fencing, depending on the time of the year, during autumn, so we're doing a lot of sowing, um, spraying. Um, and during the springtime a lot of harvesting, so uh, harvesting hay and silage and that type of thing. So it definitely varies uh, throughout the year. What are some of the opportunities that some people don't know about? Um, I guess it's probably the pathways that can lead you through the industry. So um, like you guys, you can leave school, um, probably do a traineeship, uh, work through an apprenticeship. Um, into a 2IC two, two uh, position, farm manager, um, and then maybe build yourself up into a share farmer position where you've actually got some equity within the business. So there's definitely some really good pathways um, within the industry. So what got you interested in the dairy farm in the first place? Um, so I was yeah, born and raised on a dairy farm, so I've lived it my whole life. I've, I've always loved it, really enjoyed working with cattle, enjoy working outdoors, enjoy growing grass, so all those things are, are great linkages to dairy farming, so yeah, it's just a passion of mine. So somebody to get into the dairy industry, what pathway would they have to take? Um, I guess you guys, as far as year 11 and 12, um, you need to look at the subjects you're doing, so subjects related to science, I guess, um, technology, there's quite a bit of technology now used in ag, um, and then yeah, looking to maybe get in a traineeship once you leave school and progress from there. Thanks Ben, it's been great to get inside knowledge about the industry. Hopefully it gives kids a better idea what they have to go through and what pathways they have to take.